The 2023 governorship candidate of the Social Democratic Party, SDP, in River State, Senator Magnus Abe, has called on Rivers people to provide an enabling environment for Governor Seminalai Fubara to bring out his best in servicing the state as governor. He further asked Rivers people to give the governor the needed time to settle down in office for people to benefit the dividends of democracy in the state. At this point, I will not rate the governorship of Similar Fubara in seven months because I don't think it is fair to him or fair to Rivers people. Mm -hmm. I think what the governor needs is an atmosphere in which he can bring out his best for people to see. And I don't think that that atmosphere has been created as at this time. Mm -hmm. I think that we should, as a people, give him an opportunity to bring out his best. Let him display what he's capable of. There can only be one governor at a time. If those who are called to help the governor to serve the state genuinely serve the state, we will make progress. It doesn't matter what anybody else uh, thinks or does. It's not, it's not the governor. But where people, rather than serve the state, will choose to serve an individual above the state, we can't make any progress in that kind of atmosphere. On the resignation of the factional speaker, Edison Ehe, from the River State House of Assembly, Senator Magnus Abe noted that the decision of the lawmaker may be connected to the comment by Governor Fubara over the implementation of the presidential proclamation. I support the president. I believe that we should give him an opportunity to make the country better for all of us. And I will continue to do so while I have that belief that Nigeria can be made better and he can make it better. And the decision as to the party you join is your own first and foremost. But if you work in a group, people understand what group interest is. So those who are with me, who left the APC because of me, there are people who left the APC because of me. There are people who stayed in the APC. It's not all of us who left the APC. The only people who left the APC were the candidates. They were the only ones that we registered in the SDP. Others, we never registered them in SDP. You can find out. So we knew what we were doing. We planned it as politicians, and we're very aware of the gravity and consequences of what we we're doing. Right. So there is no law that says I must remain in any particular political party. That's not the way it works. And those who follow me always understood that we will go back to the APC at the appropriate time. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.